Hey Magic fans, welcome back. Captain Clyde here. We're done with our next six boxes, our final and third case of set boosters for Kaldheim. And here's what we're looking at. So, from the Mythic slot, you can see we got a lot of juicy things. Mm -hmm. Two different Voron Collexes. One of them with the Phyrexian man, um, Phyrexian writing, very nice. Three Tibbles. Uh, <coughs> two Comas, one Azika, one Goldspan Dragon, and a rather large assortment of other rares that uh, were below $5. So, if we look at the Mythics, <coughs> excuse me, we had a total of 28 Mythics with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 of them at the filming of the video being more than $5. As a matter of fact, this is the only $5 one. All the rest of these up here, these are around 10 to 20. These, of course, are around 40 to 50. Uh, so just counting those in general, we got $224 just in Mythics out of these six boxes. It's pretty sweet. Next, we'll go over to our rare section. We'll start off with our normal rares. Right here, we got a nice pile. So, um, obviously, I just do the rares. Like I tell you guys, I average them about $2 a piece. Um, we had 213 rares, uh, so that's about $426. So that's not too shabby. Um, down here, we have our foils. So we had a lot of foil rares. Um, amazingly enough, we got no foil mythics. Um, which is really sad, but I mean with the mythic count we got over here I'm pretty sure like you know these or maybe even this is probably taking those mythic slots that used to be foil um, but With that said we had two cards that were above five dollars that were actual foil rares are worth money um, So not too shabby uh, there was 19 foil rares uh, in total uh, these are worth about 15 bucks um, so basically that gives you a full rare, about one in every nine packs is what I average it out to be. Um, and with 213 rares, that's about one for one or 1.1 per pack of, of rare. So on average, you're going to have more than one rare. Uh, when we get over here to the actual list cards, uh, we had about 46 list cards, which is very similar to the rest of the other boxes that we had. A little higher than usual. Uh, unfortunately, we only had a couple that were worth money, but man, did we hit some big money, big money cards. We got a $50 food chain, you know, like a $15, $10, $20 mystical tutor. We got $40 packs, 10 or 20, 20, 8. So hit real good right there. <clears throat> the list cards were $166 by themselves. Um, that's very similar to the last six boxes that we hit. Uh, so with that said, all in all, total box value of this entire thing, uh, we're looking at about $831, which is honestly lower than our first box, or our first set, our first case of set boosters, uh, but higher than our last one. So it's really kind of weird <coughs> how these numbers play out. Um, and I mentioned before in the other videos too, um, how the rares slash mythics added together came to a certain number. Uh, the first box of six ended up being 239 Mythics and Rares together. Uh, the second box ended up being 239, maybe 238. I had a little bit of a, I found an uncommon in there when I was digging around during the video. <clears throat> but still, it's only one card off. Uh, here, 213 Rares, 28 Mythics, that's 241. So we're really floating right around the 239 to 240, 41 mark. Um, if you open six boxes of set boosters, that's probably what you're going to get. Um, as far as Mythics go, we had 24, uh, 32, and this one was 28. Uh, even though this one had a lot more high dollar Mythics than normal than the regular Mythics that you've seen in, every, in all the other stuff. <clears throat> so we come over here. You can see we got uh, eight signed art cards, which is pretty sweet. Then we obviously we had the rest of them there. This. And we had a little stack of actual foil lands. So that was pretty nice as well. So with that, I'd like to say thanks, guys. Uh, I really appreciate it. Uh, it's sad to see this come to an end, but I had a lot of fun cracking all these packs and getting all this done. <clears throat> Friday, I'm going to put up another video. Uh, in this video, I'm just going to go over the, the statistics of what those 18 boxes look like. And I'm going to give you a, a little bit better money breakdown of what I'm going to do with these cards um, when I sell them, how much I'm expecting to get for them, 
And of course, markets will are, the markets kind of fluctuate up and down. So um, remember, these are just ballpark numbers as we go about this. Um, so I look forward to seeing you guys then. Uh, until then, have fun, play some magic, get together your friends and family, and as always, guys, be kind to each other. Until next time, I'll see you later.